Hey guys, what's going on? It's Fragit, and this is kind of just... Uh, it's a, a life story. Um, this is the time that I, uh... Had, basically, uh, a bomb threat at my high school. So... The day was, like... It was a Friday, so it, was a, it was a football game day, which for band, it's pretty big for us, because we could play up the assemblies and all that. So, um, oh, Call of Duty quit. <laughs> I guess not. But we were uh, playing after that, after the pep rally. Um, I had to find something for my instrument at the time, and then um, I find it, go back to band room, put everything up, and start heading to my, like, uh, my next class. So... <laughs> We, um, me and one of my friends were walking, and someone comes over the intercom and says, please take roll now and, um, take your children out to the Jefferson Montessori field, which is the other, the other school over near us. I think that's its name, Montessori. Um, no, not, it was another school, Monterey or something, but... I was like, well, what's going on? I walk into class and we had a sub. I'm like, oh, great. This is going to be fun. So, I get into class, ask what's happening there. She's all, leave right now. I'm like, okay. And... and she told us, you need to leave right now. I'm like, okay. So, I start walking over there and try to find friends while I'm walking over to the other school kind of which is it's not that far so i'm walking and i found one of my friends and he he's all what's happening i'm like i don't know i just saw all of this and hey this guy's got my first name <laughs> but he's all someone called in a bomb threat i'm like really he's all not really called in he's all someone wrote there's three bombs around the school and all that i was like Really, what dumbass would do this? So, I'm walking over. Like, oh, this is fun. Oh God, China Lakes. I have zero credits too. But we had a whole bunch of uh, people just walking over there, talking about it and everything. So we sit outside for about an hour, and they tell us that they're gonna start searching our bags. My Lord, I have never seen so many drugs and alcohol and weapons on school grounds because kids were just dropping them as they were going so they wouldn't get taken away and for me I mean I'm a good kid <laughs> but we were just like oh okay they're gonna check our bags I got nothing wrong I have food and all my diabetic stuff so, we get through lines, and the school isn't done. I mean, like, the the police officer and all that, they're not done with the whole, like, checking of the school and everything. So, they're still doing that. And so, some kids decided to, like, run off campus because they had things in their bag they shouldn't. <laughs> get the hell out of there. You have 33 seconds. Um, I was like, oh, I want to leave. That'd be nice. But no, I didn't leave. I stayed there with friends, and then once they said that, like, one part of the building was her, which was the, uh, which was the, the gym. I mean, if they wouldn't have searched it as thoroughly, oh, God, something could have gone down. But, um, oh, not to mention, that was, um, I was dating this one girl at the time, and that day was our six months being together. I was like, oh, this is such a great six months, and yeah, I'm not even going to start talking about her after this, because it just makes me depressed. So, <laughs> that happened, and there's just like, we still had our, um, our football game and everything, but like, we waited in the, uh, the gym for like almost half the whole day half of the day because of um no oh. this is why I can't shoot with shit.
Boom. I swear to God, it's not this laggy when I when I usually play. But um, we were just having fun and everything. We're like, oh, okay, this is probably just a prank, and what it t it ended up being. And people thought it was like funny. I I'm not camping, but I enjoyed just having like half the day off but that's like one of the scariest moments I've had in school right now and I mean that's when I was a uh, sophomore so that was well over two years ago because I'm gonna be a senior this year and <laughs> we like a hundred levels of persona 63 oh Jesus but I had fun with my friends and th that current person which I'm not gonna name at this time but um it's just weird having something like that happen to you in high school because it's like oh shit I could have died which I really couldn't have but that's what most of us thought at that point cuz like oh yeah shit death's doorstep which I've already been on but people are people are stupid where I live just pointing that out and apparently I'm camping yes I am camping though but that's one that's one of the things that's happened in high school I mean I have a whole laundry list of stories for you guys but uh, after we got out um, I ended up like I had lunch like where where the uh, where I usually sit in the like the gym it's where all the band kids sit like we're one big happy family but we sit there the whole day and then we go to lunch then after lunch we go to like our sixth period and seventh period and basically do nothing for like the rest of the day so so how do these credits work I have no fucking clue but I haven't died yet so I don't know my deed round survived but that was my story for well, my scariest story right now for high school but as always guys this is Fragit signing off peace out